Hey everybody, Jared back again, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at Smart Volume Control, an application that's so unique I decided it needed a video all of its own. So right off the bat here you notice it's got a pretty cool looking UI. We also have some different tabs that gives us access to all the different functionalities of this application right across the top there. Now of course we do have profiles and scheduling, but we also have GPS profiles as well, which we'll talk about in just a moment here. Uh, speed mode, or speed volume, I'm sorry, as well as headphones mode, which are two different features of this application that really kind of set this um, application in its own category, in my opinion. Now we'll go ahead and jump into profiles here. You'll You'll notice we've got some different uh, predefined profiles which of course you can actually customize each of those um, to make your own and then of course click on edit and you can rename them so I've actually renamed the normal mode to home and kind of made it my own we've got speed volume and headphones mode which I said I'll talk about in just a moment here of course we've got scheduling which isn't really much new to a lot of you guys out there however what kind of volume control wouldn't be complete without some scheduling uh, we've got GPS places which is really really neat um, let's say for instance you want to have different profiles set up for work, home, school, you know, whatever the play, uh, the, the situation might be, uh, you can actually set up these geolocations so that when you go to those particular locations, these profiles automatically kick in and set everything that you've customized. You can also set up Wi-Fi settings, Bluetooth settings, and mobile data to, turn, to uh, turn on or off depending on those particular profiles. Or again, if you have the uh, GPS places set up, then, you know, Wi-Fi or Bluetooth or whatever it may be will turn on or off based on your settings. You can also change and customize the particular ringtones for each one of these different categories um, based on your profile. We also have call forwarding, which is really neat. So let's say, for instance, you wanted to go for lunch and you've got a coffee shop, or maybe every time you leave work during a certain time based on the scheduling, um, you want your calls to be forwarded to your assistant or whoever. Well, you've got that option right there. Now let's take a look at the two different options that really make this application stand out from the rest. Uh, this particular one is speed volume mode. So let's say for instance, you've got a profile set up so when you're heading to work, um, you know, it tends to get a little bit loud sometimes on the bus. You know, as the engine starts speeding up, maybe you're on the train, maybe you're even riding your bike to work, things start to get a little bit louder when you start to go faster. You can actually have this automatically adjust the volume based on your speed, which is so cool. I mean, who does that? That is just amazing. Now, if we go ahead and move over to headphones, let's say, for instance, you're on the bus and you've got your music blaring in your headphones, you're listening to a movie or, or sorry, you're watching a movie, you're watching a show, whatever it may be. Wouldn't it be embarrassing if you bent over to tie up? your shoelaces and you know maybe your headphones cable got caught on your zipper and it yanked your headphones out of your device and it started blaring whatever it is you were listening to to everybody around you that's going to be a little bit embarrassing this particular feature here allows your device to be completely muted on any one of these particular um uh, selections here when your headphone becomes unplugged and of course this is toggleable based on those particular profiles which is really really cool so in addition to all these really great features and functions that this application provides you with you know this is one of those um, set and forget type applications now when I say set and forget, the reason I say that is because once you set up your profiles the way you want it, they also supply us with a bunch of different widgets so you don't have to go back into that application every time you want to start using it and changing your profiles and so on. And as you can see, quite a bit of widgets. Now, this particular widget um, I thought was really, really useful because not only does it allow you all the different manual controls of each particular category, but you've got your different speed control modes here, your speed volume control uh, profiles there. You also have all of your standard profiles ready to go right at your fingertips right from a widget, as well as your scheduling toggles, your geolocation toggle, your headphones mode toggle, as well as that speed volume toggle. And you have a quick little option to jump into the settings right there. And yes, this is where you can do all of your call forwarding from all of this right from one widget. How friggin' amazing is that? That's pretty impressive in my books. Now, this application is the pro version. There's also a light version, which is free uh, with th some uh, you know, different limitations. 
Um, the pro version, this one is $3.99 from the Play Store. Now I'll be posting a link in the description below to the free version for you guys to go and check out. Um, I really think you owe it to yourself to try it out, you know, see what you think about it. And, you know, I have a feeling a lot of you guys will end up pay purchasing the uh, pro version in the end, just based on all the, um, you know, added features that it gives you. Uh, anyways, guys, that is smart volume control. Again, I'll be posting a link in the description below for you guys to go and download it right away. Um, let me know what you think about it in the comments below. Have you ever seen an application like this before? I personally have it with all of these particular features. Uh, anyways, guys, that's it. If you like this video, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, all of which can be done down below, uh, as well as follow me on Twitter, Google+, or Facebook if you need to. Uh, that's it for now. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Cheers.